Tiger's Blood Cleaner, DetailJuice.com. All right. Tiger's Blood Cleaner, take two. You can see all the browning on the tires. Tried to shoot this a minute ago and on the front wheel over there and the overspray got all over the camera. So I'm gonna shoot it again on a fresh tire and wheel and fender well. So you notice the browning on the tire? That's the preservative that the manufacturer puts in the rubber uh, so that uh, the rubber stays, uh, it retains its elasticity and its flexibility and doesn't dry rot. So during the course of uh, driving, centrifugal force spins the tires fast and it pushes all of that browning out. So that's the browning is the preservative in the rubber. Uh, you know, it's a very common misconception that it's silicone based tire dressing or whatever, but it is actually the preservative in the tire. But you'll notice these wheels are absolutely disgusting. Fender wheels are nasty, but I am going to show you how to fix all of that with very little, if any, drama. So I have Tiger's Blood diluted 50-50 in this pump sprayer. I like these pump sprayers for this particular product because I use a lot of it and it's easier than using a trigger sprayer. So I'm gonna go ahead and just put just a light coat on the tire. Make sure it's evenly distributed on the wheel. Make sure I get inside the lug nut holes and also I'm gonna hit the fender well. If you get a little bit on the paint, no big deal. Just don't let it dry there. So, I got my AR Blue Clean 112S pressure washer and I'm going to hit this thing, I'll bring you back here so that I don't get overspray on you again. And then I'm gonna hit it with the pressure washer and show you how clean I can get these wheels with just Tiger's blood and the pressure from the pressure washer, no actual scrubbing. the lug nut hole area very well and then inside the fender well there you have it I didn't scrub nothing and the wheel the tire and the fender well look awesome it got all the dirt and grime off without me having to actually take a brush to it. Tiger's Blood Cleaner, pretty amazing. Just go ahead and show you the bottle while I've got you out here. I know I have a bottle of that stuff somewhere, or maybe not, maybe I poured it in the, uh, yeah, I poured it in the uh, deal here and put water in it. So that's probably that's a 16 ounce bottle with water, so it's probably diluted more than 50-50, but whatever, I don't pay a lot of attention to that. You definitely should. Don't take my advice on that. You'll get the most out of your products if you use them, use them per the directions um, and that kind of thing, but I think that you'll get the most, you'll get the most like uses if you use them per my directions but i think that you know if you do your own testing you're going to get a get better performance out of the products per what you like because you know let's face it uh detailing products are a matter of opinion and everybody's got one of those that's for sure the internet is slam full of random idiots sitting behind a computer that have an opinion about things they don't know anything about so uh Tiger's Blood Cleaner. Nice clean wheel. I am gonna go clean those wheels. I just wanted to show you, I mean, with a brush, I just wanted to show you what kind of results you can get uh, with just 
a little bit of pressure and tiger's blood. Notice that the tire is uh, all nice and, and black again in, instead of having all that browning all over it. Now, I can get even more browning. Uh, I've got all the surface browning off. Notice there's nothing on my finger now. I got all the surface browning off, but I'm gonna take a brush and I'm just gonna use a hard bristle brush to get the rest of that off. But again, this is just a demo on showing you what Tiger's Blood is capable of with no scrubbing. All right, I'm still working on these wheels. This is the last one. And I'm still using the Tiger's Blood. But I wanted to let you guys know that Tiger's Blood Cleaner can be used on lots of different stuff. It can be used on the interior, can be used on the exterior, it removes tar. It's essentially a heavy duty degreaser. You can use it on the engine bay, all kinds of stuff. It's more aggressive than infinite purpose cleaner, but I just want to mention, just because it's in the motorcycle lineup doesn't mean that you can't use it on your car. I mean, this is obvious, I'm using it now. Um, you can see just with a quick spray how much browning it gets off the tires. I mean, and I literally just sprayed it on. I didn't do anything to achieve those results. And so all I'm doing now is I got my fancy boar's head br hair brush right here and I sprayed the Tiger's Blood Cleaner on. I'm just gonna scrub down the tires and the wheel faces because you can't really see the barrels on these. And but beyond that, the owner wouldn't know that I cleaned them, wouldn't care that I cleaned them, even if I did clean the barrels. She wouldn't know either way, and neither, and, and nor would she care. Um, you know, so in my efforts to please the customer, not myself, I'm not going to waste time doing those. So this is where we're at, and that is super clean now. All you got to do... Take a little pressure, hit the fender well, hit the wheel and tire, and there you go. So, I wouldn't be so consumed at whether my products say motorcycle on them or not, I would be I, I would I, I am definitely saying that you're gonna be doing yourself an injustice if you don't use the motorcycle products on your car if you have the opportunity just see how you like them compared to the car products you'll find that my line simplifies your life and if you're in this to make money it's gonna help you to make more money that's important so Tiger's blood cleaner detailjuice.com so thanks so much for watching have a wonderful day. I am sweating to death, but this has been Tiger's Blood Cleaner, DetailJuice.com. There's no other manufacturer on the planet that you can get a direct line to anytime you need it. So let me know if I can help you. Have a wonderful day. And check out Tiger's Blood at DetailJuice.com.